Hello everyone, welcome to a small terrible YouTube channel. This is Mam Asenho at your service. Today, I have a good news to, to you, my audience there, uh, to the students, to my code or to my fellow teachers. I have this good news that I am going to present to you today. So the good news that I am um, referring to a while ago is all about this wordwall.net. Again, it's wordwall.net. So this is a platform for all the teachers out there to make and customize their activities for their online classroom. So there are a lot of activities here that you can create in which uh, your students can also easily answer. All they have to do is they are going to write their names. There is no need for the, your students to sign up in this platform. It's very user-friendly. So as you can see, there are a lot of vlogs here telling that teachers love WordWall. For example, this computing an ICT teacher of uh, or from the United Kingdom he says creating resources from scratch is a risk the ease of use means carefully planned word walls can be used alongside off the cuff creations as lessons figure off on a tangent another music teacher many students really love word wall it allows me to reach out to the gaming generation with a minimum or effort and preparation. Wordwell is helping me to grow as a teacher. Yes, because she can notice um, this generation, the students are on gaming. Another teacher, you can take any resource and just tweak it. Do something different at the beginning of class, a plenary at the end, create a crossword for homework, it's literally type it in. Boom, go. Another teacher says, it's so easy to create activities, it makes planning a lot quicker. My students love the tactile nature of the activities and it makes a nice change from pen and paper. Another teacher from Croatia, I'm really satisfied with using WordWall. I like the simplicity of creating and editing new interactive materials. It's very user-friendly, so as what I have told you a while ago, it's user-friendly. I use it with my students and we are absolutely crazy about the activities I can prepare. I am so happy that I can print activities. Yes, we can also print activities from WordWall. Another teacher, enormous educational potential. Generally, I use free apps, but for WordWall, I made an exception. Another teacher, from United Kingdom, WordWall takes vocabulary games and reviews into the digital world and is easy to use for teachers and learners. If you are looking to add a new digital tool to your teaching, this is a very good place to start. Yes, I tried uh, making activities a while ago and yes, I shared it in my FB page and I also tried to answer it as a student. It's very easy. All I have, all I did was enter my name there. So let's try. Let's let's start. If you are a first-time user of this WordWall.net, all you have to do is click sign up and just click sign up to this one. Sign in with Google if you have your Google account. But if you don't have, you're going to create your um, email address here, password, confirm password, and this here. But if you have this Google, it's very easy. All you have to do is sign with Google and to run. It's already available. Since I um, or I have done signing up a while ago, I'll just click login, then sign in with Google. And see, I have told you 
I created already an activity. So just like this activity, so all the student can see is this one. They are going to just click start and this will appear. So but before that they will be prompted to write their names before they are going to start. So for example this one, all they have to do is see they are going to drag the letters and arrange them to create a word. So there are words that should not be moved just like uh, these colored words here. So the words that you are going to move would be the gray, the gray in color, just like these words here. You can move them because they are gray. And yes. You'll have your score and the time it takes you to answer. It says I'm the first in voter vote. <laughs> anyway, so that's how this platform, Wordwall, can help you a lot as a student and at the same time as a teacher. So let's try. Okay, if you want to view the results, you can come in here, my results. And as you can see, this one, the word wall. Two students have answered it already. She just and Sishikina. So they got 30 to 32. But for just, he, uh, she answered it in just 23 seconds. So on for Shikina, it's 24 seconds or, yeah, seconds. And you can see here the frequency of error. So it's very easy for you to take note how many of your students did not get the activity so that you can reteach that activity then. And your created activities will be here, my activities. So just like this one, I have created this for my, my children here at home. So all they have to do is they are going to play this walk a mole. So they are going to just click the start. Yeah, this this very easy. They are just going to hit the numbers because it says numbers. Then there are levels that you have to complete. Okay, you are not going to touch the letters because if you do, you'll get the X there. Okay. Okay, there are plus or bonus points if you can make it well. This is very, very interesting, especially to the students' side. I noticed that when my student or my children answered these activities a while ago, they were so happy, they were so amused, amazed by this activity. Yeah, you're, they are not going to touch. Okay. So, they are just going to walk the numbers. They are not going to touch the letters. So, level 3, we are now in level 3. Wow. Now in level four, they're so cute. It can relieve your stress.
Wow, we still have level 5. Anyway, let's stop there. I know this is very amusing, but we have to proceed then. We need to proceed now. They're so cute. And the good thing is, there is a background music that will enhance the students to really answer the activity and yeah, even your your child there, your children there at home. They will be um, they will really like the game because there are or even the activities because there are background musics already. They have already this background music so you can create activity by clicking this create activity and there are a lot of activities that you can select too so match up wakamole find the match word search and jumbo missing word and a lot of activities except this hangman and open the box because they are uh, yeah this there are they are new Ah, okay, they are new. I thought they are just for pro. The pro templates are below. Okay, so uh, these templates here, templates for your interactive activities are for free here. So, yeah, I, I really find this platform very amazing. And... For example, I have the, the anagram. I know I created this anagram already. I just click this by activities is here. So if you want to print it, just like just in here, printables PDF, just click that one anagram. And yes, you can print it already. Just click print. This so this word wall is a great help to us teachers. So maybe you're a face-to-face -face learning teacher or an online uh, learning teacher. This word wall that that is a great help uh, for us to create this interactive activity. So I help I hope this helps. I hope this I this uh, the one I share to you or this word wall that that helps a lot to you because I find this a great help, a big help to us or to me as a teacher. So thank you so much for tuning in a small terrible YouTube channel for more surprise for more uh video lessons for more tutorials please do subscribe do not forget to hit the notification bell for you to be notified all the time there is a new uploaded video bye bye